Well, it's been a great summer day. Lots of sunshine and temperatures in the low 80s where they're supposed to be. We'll get even warmer tomorrow. Still, those isolated shower chances are out there. You can tell it is widely scattered. And what was a line of showers and storms in southeast of Wisconsin, Illinois, is falling apart. But we'll put still a risk late evening of a few isolated showers. Look at the highs today. 80s, most part, will be in the mid-80s tomorrow again. So there's the rain. It was a pretty solid line of showers and storms, but uh, running into the lake and some drier air and sinking air is not favorable for those storms to survive, so only in isolated showers a chance. They see it in the hour by hour, one or two will affect mid-Michigan, and that's it. We'll go back to clear skies for the overnight period. The hour by hour, let's go a little further in the middle of the week, so while all that falls apart, skies tonight, upper 50s to near 60 under clear conditions. Very sunny start. We're gonna go to the mid-80s tomorrow. This model throws a couple of isolated showers. Can't rule that out for the most part. Any shower activity comes in after dark as the system passes by south of us. So there's not a huge threat of rain. Thursday goes back to partly cloudy skies and in the upper 70s to around 80. Friday, we've got a chance of a couple of midday showers. There's a warm front coming in here to warm us up and get us in the muggy air. So there's a possibility there mid-morning. And then we get into hazy sunshine and end the day with showers and thunderstorms that will carry into early Saturday morning. Most of Saturday does look dry and pleasant. Sunday's a sunny day in 81. Kind of a wet day air on Monday. All day kind of on again, off again, showers and storms. And then partly sunny on Tuesdays, we fall back into the 70s.